Kia koutou katoa. Welcome back into breakfast. It is 13 minutes to nine. Well, it's time to get your thinking caps on. It's time to nominate people for Kiwi Bank's New Zealander of the Year Awards. This year, well, it's slightly different with a new award category looking at those who are making differences for our climates with the Environmental Hero of the Year Award, Te Toa Taiao or Te Tau. Joining us to chat about the award is this year's local hero winner, Shannon Te Huia. Morena. Morena. Thank you so much for joining us. We're having a good discussion because actually you've done some work with one of my niece, uh, nephews back um, home in the King Country. But before um, we talk about the work that you're doing to help develop others, talk to us about uh, your uh, river restoration project. Yes, so, um, Puni River Care is a marae-based restoration um, group. Um, we started in 2015 and it was a way for Rangatahi to coordinate ourselves to be involved in the restoration of our awa um, through meaningful employment, through enabling our people to be involved and yeah, just to be part of the um, solution. Beautiful, so how did how did that all start for you? I mean, we, again, we've been yeah. chatting, I mean, the environment, Taio, yeah. has been part of your world since way back when. So talk about that, and then how you ended up at this point. Yeah, I guess so. Um, so growing up, I've always been at the marae, um, so that's important. It, uh, my culture is important to me, gives me strength. Um, but also water, like I surf, dive, fish, so yeah. I love water, I love being in water. Um, but also being from the country, you know, you, you're out in the, in the Nahiri and you're out on farm, so um, those things are important. And I guess as you start getting a little bit older, you start valuing what's important to you. And so for this, it, um, yeah, it just meant something to me. Actually, how rude of me. The river restoration project that you're talking about is where? Um, <laughs> so it's a little um, little town called Kiki, um, and we're based at our marae at uh, Mangatoto, um, and we have uh, connections to our other marae within the catchment. That's at Afatiro, Aotearo, and Fakamaruma. Wicked. So this has developed also into uh, job opportunities as well. Eh? So how many people have you got working for you? Yeah, so we employ 47 people full time. Um, we are working from the marae, so we'll be out either collecting seed, growing trees, planting trees, and um, yeah, just the work. So tell me about the actual work that you're doing. Yep. Yeah. So we collect seed, so that's Modi. So we'll go into areas where there's a lot of it, like um, Parangia, um, Puriora. Um, we'll collect that, take it back to the marae. Uh, we'll process seed, uh, we'll germinate it, grow it, and we'll plant those in areas where the Modi's been depleted, uh, mostly in areas where there are no trees, um, along rivers, wetlands, and um, hillsides. Amazing. So where did, I'm trying to think of another word, but the confidence come from to be able to step into um, taking care of the environment, but actually there's a bigger picture here. I can, there's an opportunity to be able to help other uh, whānau members, yep. uh, people from your area yep. to get into employment. So yeah, where, where did that confidence come from? I guess that stems from a lot of people that have been recognised throughout this process of um, the New Zealand of the Awards. Um, it's people that have um, not settled for the status quo, who have just said, you know, um, there's got to be another way. And so, yeah, I guess that's something that we looked at. How, um, how good does it feel to not only be helping the environment, but also to be helping others? Yeah, that's, yeah, that's super satisfying. I see, um, see a lot of young people come through. Um, you see them start to find themselves. Yeah. Um, and then they move on into things that they really care about. Um, they get a sense of who they are through whakapapa, through pepeha, um, and yeah, our culture is super critical for our people, understanding where we're from. Yeah. What is that like, watching young people <laughs> come in, head down, mm. low in confidence, mm. and then to see them uh, puawe, to see them grow into, you know, not necessarily a, a, a confident person, but to actually start believing in themselves and what they have to offer this world. I mean, it's, yeah, it's aspirational. Mm. I mean, um, seeing it happen, uh, it's a numbers game. It doesn't happen all the time, but when it does, um, yeah, it's, you can't measure it, like, through, through any report. <laughs> yeah. You see it and you feel it, right? Yeah. So we were talking about uh, one of my nephews, Kamahusa, yeah. who started up a project back home uh, in Pio Pio. Yeah. So this isn't just about what you're doing in your rohe, in mm. your area. You're looking, you know, others are looking to you for help to yeah. say, you know, 
this is this is the way forward essentially so how good is that yeah that's mean and i guess that's the platform that this awards have given us i mean our reach has extended throughout aotearoa at our open day we had over 300 people turn up to the marae come all the way from dunedin all the way from um waitangi from the east coast they come from all over new zealand to um come and look at what we do um, and yeah Kim's just an example of somebody that had uh, what it takes and he worked with us for a season a year and then we um, helped support him through his mahi and setting up his own kaupapa down in Piu Piu. Yeah, and it's beautiful too. I've yeah, been watching some of the stuff that he's doing. So you talk about the platform that uh, uh, New Zealand of the Year has given you. So there's the new category this year, the Environmental Hero of the Year. I mean, how good is that to see that as a separate category? Yeah, I think the determining factor for that is that it can be, uh, it recognises groups. So um, I think that's something that I struggled with is taking single recognition for something yeah. that was uh, like it was was went from Kaumatua to our, um, our Tamariki right through to all of our marae. Um, but you know this group recognition I think will do wonders and there are a lot of good things happening throughout Aotearoa um, and I think the rest of New Zealand will be surprised at you know actually what's happening. So. Yeah we just need people to nominate right so yep. go to nzawards.org.nz nominations are open until the 31st of August. Well congratulations on being recognised, congratulations on the work um, that, you're, that you're doing. Ngā mihi ki akwe. Ngā mihi. Shannon te huia, pū niu river care. Love it. Stay with us. We will be right back after the break.